Hey everybody, forgive me if there's any background noise, but we will get started. So what we'll see is on the beginning of the week, we got inside week, inside month, inside day spies. So doing nothing, uh, how are you getting out of that, right? Go to the month, how are you getting out of that? That's our question. So we got inside days for tomorrow. We'll see what comes of that, but things could just start to dry up. Q's, same thing, inside month, inside week, inside day, how you get out of that stuff. Uh, IDBM, inside day, closer to down, right? Inside week, closer to down, so we'll see. It right? could be a little weaker than the rest. Uh, Dow Jones, inside day as well, inside week, inside month. So again, just chop, chop. We can, you know, let that stuff set up. As far as things starting the week, Lulu was a good bit weaker than the rest of the stuff going three two day down with the three one two week down and this is coming from strat alerts members but goes into exhaustion risk so we'll be aware of that broad information if we go to ulta this is from sarah's nightly or weekend video list and you see the inside week two and two reversal full time for continuity potentially causing a three to two month ulta if we go to all the airlines jets Jets has the hammer month breaking up slightly. UAL has the 2-2 month already close to its magnitude. AAL has the hammer 2-2 month. You'll see the 2-2 day to start the week. This is something I personally grabbed, so we'll see how that plays out. Uh, DAL, also 2-2 day to start the week. 2-up week, hammer month in force. So you got a lot of the Jets in there. Jet Blue is also coming up a bit. You'll see this big old three on the two week chart so we'll see what comes of that still a big old one on the month there <clears throat> and then alk alaska airlines you can see two up week two two month so simultaneous break airlines for certain there um outside of that there was some defensive moving today lockheed martin had the inside day up to start the week with general dynamics gd kicking to start the week with the defense sector two up on the day to start the week a little stronger but still stuck inside there um and then as far as going into tomorrow, let me see, make sure I'm not, not missing anything. Yeah, so we also had on the relative strength list, PFE going RevStrat week up to start the week. And then we had some gappers, PLTR, boom, 3-2 day, boom, kicking slightly on the week, 2-2. Two, two. And then boom, 3-2 month up. So this is a definite buy. This is something we definitely want to be looking at the rest of the week. Um, and outside of that, in the financials, there was some Visa, some MasterCard getting started. Uh, mostly continuations there. You got some RevStrat Quarter Enforced MasterCard. Got some RevStrat Quarter Enforced Visa. So we'll see what comes of that. Uh, but you will see a lot of inside days. So if you just quickly go to this. <laughs> Forgive the picture there. It's from the Morning Wood that came out. <laughs> the Strat Time Report. But um, if we go Week Enforce. You see Enforce on the week, 18 names, so it's 50-50 to start the week. Notice healthcare's that's where most of the weakness was. We did have some pretty good setups for members in there, specifically CVS. Notice this. So this is something we look for, the PMG, and you'll see what happened. Boom, 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 boom. And then they just take them all out. So really cool stuff there to start the week. We'll see you know, if anything comes that. We'll see Bristol Myers also a little bit weaker in there. To start the week with the week breaking down PMG. So if they come back tomorrow, maybe that follows through. Um, but, you know, it's just kind of hit or miss. There's not a ton of signals in force up or down to start the week. Um, but this is going to be where your signals are in force. Uh, setting up into tomorrow, we would like to know about rev strats ideally. So we can start there. So CI, UNH, and healthcare is probably... Trying to recover, CI inside day, slight hammer, UNH, hammer counter shooter day, would have full time from continuity and a quarterly signal at the top of the broadening formation. So, you know, maybe that gets bigger, but, um, you know, not too interesting there in my opinion. If we go to shooter, HPE and K, so, you know, not much there here either, HPE, so that could be rev strat 122, boom, 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 take those guys out to start the week. Uh, dead stuck inside week though, inside month still. So we'll see K, which is Kellogg's. And yeah, a whole lot of nothing there. So nothing on the hammer shooter list there in the rev strats. We go two down in green. Looks like it's, you know, just a few things. DTE and utilities. Nah, right. CHD, CI. Yeah, so CHD probably a better looking one there in the rev strat day with the 2-2 two -two month in force. CHD, so that will go on the list for sure. We go to 
CMA. Also, you know, not a bad looking one. It's still inside month though, but you got some pivot machine gun through here. Probably good for the small account guys, so we'll keep it on the list. Uh, if you go two up in red, C-O-R-D-V-A-E-W, some more health cares. So C-O-R, that could rev strat and then take out the bottom of the daily broadening information. Could cause some range expansion there. And notice daily try, you're also at the top of the major broadening information like so. So if this works, you can take these guys out. And if that works, you can take all these guys out. So C-O-R, we'll keep that on the rev strat. And then we will have DVA and EW. DVA, also you can see the rev strat day could cause rev strat week. So DVA, this is something we want to know about. PMG here. And since we already see some of the healthcare is being on the downside list, this would confirm that, which could give you more evidence for the short there. And you'll notice all these are healthcare's, right? So these three would all confirm potentially. If we get an EW. Uh, looks like soft rev strat, not a shooter signal, but let's see. You know, it could cause inside month down. The only thing is it's very inside month at this point. So, you know, maybe that works, but you'll notice we got some distance to take out uh, previous month's lows. So maybe it works, especially with simultaneous break. We could see that uh, if you go on like a two week chart, you know, could start getting out of that, but it's just an issue when you go into exhaustion risk like this and you're stuck inside month. Uh, we don't know. Uh, that being said, though, COR DVA will keep it on there. If we go to three twos, we go two down in green to start. So cyclicals, and I'm going to start going quicker through this. Sorry about that again. <laughs> it's like a jump scare, right? APTV, nah, Burl. Nah, DRI. This is Home Builders, I believe. Three, three, two, two, potentially with a slight hammer there. Could cause full time frame continuity. If you go to XHB, not so much there. And DRI, I don't believe that's actually home builders. DHI is home builders. EDU, consumer defensive, meh, NRG utilities. So NRG, you know, it could get moving through here outside week. 322 on a Tuesday. Put it on the 322 list. Then I will have the list at the very end of the video here. TTWO. And look at that. 322, nice big hammer. That's something we're looking for. Still an inside month, but big old hammer right there I'd like to know about. And that is 322. So 11322. <laughs> we got Revstrat and then Counter Revstrat. And that's Communication Services with WBD. Also 3322 on a Tuesday, potentially. Uh, dead inside month, though. If we go to W Day, that could go 322 two as well. Still an inside month, but it could start working its way back through. It's on a gapper name, so W Day is a part of the gap universe. Fills that trade the gaps. And that's about it on the 3 2 down in green. We could also look at hammers, see if there's anything that we missed. Doesn't look like we did miss anything. All right, let's go shooter. More healthcare, 322, 3322 in ALGN, which could, looks like it's going to be inside month still. Roblox, communication services, closer to 3-3 three, three on the week with a 2-2 two, two on a Tuesday to do it. Would it also have to go outside, outside month, Roblox. Uh, so that could be a good one. Should you get moving back under 4233 and staying in there? You can see the try in the day. Got to get out of this thing. And if you do come back through this stuff back in here. So we will see. And this is on the bearish side of things, right? Go to team. Inside month stuck. And notice we want to trigger other participation groups. So TT could trigger the three, two week down. Back through the weekly try, which could cause three, three months. So TT, this is something I'd like to know. Never traded it before. Normally that means the options are a little spreadier, but also can mean bigger percent moves or bigger gains because of those spreads and the lack of liquidity. Uh, normally they don't price in quite as much. So Etsy, that's having some interesting problems to start the week. Three, two down week, three, two down day to start the week. 
and Etsy is two down years. So just like Arc, it's trying to you know go back to zero. <laughs> um, so you know that's not a bad one to know about for the strat attack. You got momentum shooter. So I will throw that in here. Let's see, this is list at this point. I believe we'll also have Momo in eBay. Yeah, so eBay went 3-3. Three, three. I know some people in the Discord are watching that, but we'll see. Uh, Rivian. Also a slight Momo there. So nothing too much else to add there. If we go to 2-up two and red. I believe we already did that. Yep, so got most of the 3 2 there. And now we'll go after 3-1s. So there's 88 3-1s. And I like to go after the bigger market caps. So I'm going to filter, and now we have 30. I'm going to filter by direction, and now there's 15. So tech, APH, stuck inside week, inside month at this point, so we'd prefer let that try grow. AXP, very stuck so far. Cat, 3-1, very stuck so far. It is red on the month, so it could start puking. Dow Jones is inside, right? Um, EMR Industrials, 3-1 is a two on the month, so EMR would be a little better. ETN, three, one. So a lot of industrial stuff in there. Um, outside of that, CRM technology, three, one, and this one's could go three, two down month, if that works, CRM. And that's something we also have from the gap list. So this is a gap or universe name. We go to Oracle. I believe that it has earnings tomorrow, so Oracle Gappers. Um, don't know how I'm going to start tracking this going forward, but I'm going to try and keep some of the higher liquidity names on the gap list after they have gapped, uh, so we continue to go through that stuff. But we'll see, Pan W. 131 still inside week inside month nowhere near two up so unless this were to go through on two down you know you got this daily trend here that you could work with but you are stuck inside bigger time frames if you go to tsm in the semis big old three one so this could cause three one two to cause the week so tsm if the semis were to be strong or trying to recover this would probably be the one to go after so we can go Could have relative strength in ships simply because of how close it'd be to taking out you can see that open of last week causing anyone that was short last week to take an immediate loss just like what happened in pltr today where anyone short last week takes a loss unlike spy where no one last week short is taking a loss besides anyone that shorted friday um and then as far as indexes go xbi biotechs are three one day at the bottom of their three one inside week to start um and then communications, 3-1 day as well, which is like your Roblox. Uh, Meta is on there, 3-1, so we'll make sure to have that. In the technologies, don't know how I missed that one. CRM, Pan W, Oracle. So with Oracle Gapper tomorrow, we'd actually prefer it is, it is gapping up as far as I know. We'd prefer the gap up sell and rev strat through all this stuff. Obviously, Oracle has been killing it, so I don't know if that's going to be the case, but really, it's probably not going to do too much. We'll let that open a good bit, but that is about all I got for you guys to start the new week, so I hope you guys are having a good time. We did have a few posts on Twitter. We did not have the weekend video, so that being said, we're just going to get at it. A uh, lot of inside stuff, so stick on that gap list if you can, and then we'll see what comes of any actionable signals. It does look like IDBM is gapping down after hours. Looks like spies gap, but now slightly. Oops. Nope. Forgive me. Nope. Spies closer to two up. IDBM. Sorry. IDBM is closer to two down. Dow Jones closer to nothing. And Q's closer to two up. So we will see. Let them open. And we just got a lot of inside stuff. So don't be too quick to trade, especially if you are new to the strat. That being said, hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys in the next video.